Good morning children, Saira. Welcome back to our English class. So today we are going to learn active English, a new chapter which will help you to talk in your conversation. So today's chapter is chapter number 25 and this is a very very simple chapter. So you are going to listen first, no writing now. So you are going to listen first till the end this video and then you will review your book and then write the answer on your own. Since it is a easy chapter, you are I'm not going to show you the answers. So just listen carefully. Now here the table is given here and the question is make 16 one six sixteen sentences. So you are going to make 16 sentences using this table. Okay, now here we have three columns. So I'm going to read and read and show you the first column. Number one, that is the boy. That is the boy. So number one, that is the boy. Number two, that is not the girl. Number three, there is the boy. Number four, she is the girl. I hope you all know what is this sentence means. That is the boy. That is not the girl. There is the boy. She is the girl. Okay. Now in the middle column here it is given W H O who. And in the last column, sits next to me, painted the picture, drew the horse, bought the big kite. Going to read you again. Sits next to me, painted the picture, drew the horse, bought the bay kite. Okay. Now, here first column four lines, middle column only one word and the last column four lines. So, what you are going to do is, you are going to make 16 sentences, right? So, you will take the first one. Number one. So, what number one sentence what you will write? That is the boy, okay, who, then the first one, sits next to me. So, what is the first sentence? That is the boy who sits next to me, okay. So, you will write T-H-A-T that is the Boy who sits next to me. Full stop. And number two sentence. Again you will write that is the boy who painted the picture. So this is number one. This is number 2, this is number 3, this is number 4. So number 2 sentence what you will write? That is the boy who painted the picture. Number 3. That is the boy who drew the horse. And number 4. That is the boy who bought the big kite. Isn't it simple? So, this, that is the boy, you will write four times. How many times? Four times. So, that is the boy, that is the boy, that is the boy, that is the boy. Then you will write who sits next to me, who painted the picture, 
who drew the horse, who bought the big kite. Got it? And same way, number two. So, now number four is over. Now fifth. Fifth sentence. So, five, six, seven, eight will be that is not the girl, that is not the girl, that is not the girl, that is not the girl. So, you write that is not the girl who sits next to me. That is not the girl who painted the picture. That is not the girl who drew the horse. That is not the girl who bought the big kite. So, five, six, seven, eight, you will use that is not the girl. Got it? Yes. Now, next we will move on to number five, six, seven, eight. Now, we will go to number nine. So, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So, question number nine, ten, eleven, twelve. You are going to write, there is the boy, there is the boy, there is the boy, there is the boy. So, you are going to start with, there is the boy who, there is the boy who sits next to me. There is the boy who painted the picture. There is the boy who drew the horse. There is the boy who bought the big cake. Got it? And next one. 13, 14, 15, 16. So, question number 13. So, third. Sorry. So, question number 13. So, question number 13, 14, 15 and 16. You will use, she is the girl. She is the girl, she is the girl, she is the girl, she is the girl. So, you will write, she is the girl who sits next to me. She is the girl who painted the picture. She is the girl who drew the horse. She is the girl who watched the big guy. Over 16 sentences. Okay. So each line that is the boy, the first column. So the first column four times, four times, four times, four times. So T for times. So it will become 16 sentences. Okay, children. Now we'll move on to the next page. So our next page is also quite simple. The question is join the sentences using who? W H O who. Join the sentences using who. And this is also very simple. So, what you are going to do is, let us read the first one. The answer is given. Number one. I know a man. He has adopted 10 children. Adopted means the children who don't have their father and mother, their parents. So, he has adopted. He has made his own children so this man this man he has adopted 10 children okay now how will you join it is so simple you are going to cut this pronoun here he so i know a man he has adopted 10 children so who is he here that is a man who is he? A man. So, a man is already there. So, instead of writing 
T. So you are not going to write that T again. So instead of you will write T, you will write W H O 2. So the answer is I know a man who has adopted 10 children. So same way number 2. I met a woman. She has very long hair. So who is she here? Women. So you cut she, he. So everywhere you will cut this pronoun. So in all the persons you cut the pronoun and you will write the word who. Okay. So number two. I'll write and show you the answer. Same you will write. I met a woman. So you will write. I met a woman. Now what you will write? Who? Who? Then you will continue. So here you will not write she. So instead of she you will write who has very long hair. Full stop. Got it? Yes. So number three. I know a man. He wants to buy a car. I know a man who wants to buy a car. Number four. I have a friend. She has never been to the movie hall to watch a movie. So I have a friend who has never been to the movie hall to watch a movie. And uh, number five, this is the boy. He told me the story. So what you will do first, you will cut this pronouns. So who is he here? Boy. And number six, man. Number seven, girl. Number eight, boy. So what is the answer number five? This is the boy. Who told me the story? Number six answer. Here is the man who brings the food. Number seven. There is the girl who picked the flowers. Number nine. Sorry, number eight. That is the boy. He lost the ball. So... So number 8 answer, that is the boy who lost the ball. Number 9, I would like to meet the man who builds that building. Number 10, this is the boy who found the money. Number 11, this is the woman who makes our clothes. And the last one. Here is a boy who here is a boy who wants to tell you something. So children, complete your book. You have my number, WhatsApp number. You can take from the group standard three. And after completing this page, this chapter number 25, write the date, write good handwriting. And click the photo and send it to me in my personal WhatsApp number. Okay, children? So, all the best. Bye-bye. See you. And so, complete the book and send me the answer. So, thank you, children.